let's focus on a couple of earnings then. The Nifty Bank is underperforming. And one such outperformer actually is one of the biggest underperformers from the banking space. CSP Bank, the stock has done more than 5% in trade after posting numbers a little while back. The problem is on the margins. Abhishek joins us to run us through why the street is disappointed with these set of numbers. Abhishek. Uh, well, Nigel, the strong loan growth that they have had about 11 to 12 percent on a sequential basis uh, that has not translated into net interest margin uh, sustained at healthy levels, and it has declined on a sequential basis by about 40 50 basis point, which has not gone down well with the street. And uh, uh, if you talk about the asset quality, the slippages have increased on a sequential basis to 35 crore, uh, that is up about 35 percent on a sequential basis. However, asset quality has improved, uh, gross NP ratio is down to 1.26 versus 1.45 and net NPA ratio is down to 0.35 versus 0.42 in terms of PNL the NII is down about 0.4 percent sequentially uh, if you take a look at the breakup uh, the interest expense that has gone up by 18.9 percent sequentially despite the fact that you know deposit growth is lower than the advances growth CASA ratio has improved the increase in incremental cost of funds is pretty high for uh, CSB bank so net interest margin has has declined to 5.38 percent versus 5.8 percent in the previous quarter the cost to income ratio that's also sequentially has seen a jump uh, 57.5 percent versus 56 percent sequentially so the pat is up about 19.6 percent yoy but up just uh, 0.25 percent on a sequential basis so the able ability to not translate into meaningful name of the strong loan growth that they have had has not gone down well with this street Okay, uh, Abhishek, thank you very much for that. That CSB uh, bank uh, in terms of the numbers and the reaction. By the way.